Well, for decades now, we've been waiting for all those futuristic high-tech gadgets they promise us at every World's Fair. The flying cars, the robot maids. But now, one Victoria high-tech firm is ready to take us into the world of 3D virtual reality. Gordy Tupper has more. <laughs> Over the head. It looks like I'm sitting in the offices of Clover Point Cartographics with a big old set of goggles on, but in fact, I'm virtually strolling through the new area of Victoria's airport. It's weird. The airport doesn't exist yet, but how, how can we be in it already? We've created it for the airport and we just ported it into this, into this software so that you can see it through those goggles. Carl Swanee is the CTO as in technical officer at Clover Point and he makes it all sound so simple. It is absolutely brand new. That actually, the goggles just came up. And lots of friends and family were at the company's open house to check out 3D virtual reality. The one that we have beside you has a uh, roller coaster on it, mm -hmm. so it takes you through a virtual roller coaster ride. Erica, what did you think about that? It was lots of fun. It was very interesting to be able to move and actually do what it was that I was doing with my hands. Now, video games aside, I found that wandering the halls of a future building was fascinating. And by the way, you're seeing the TV version of this program with the goggles on. I'm totally immersed in it. Wait till I take you down the stairs. You're going to grab onto the desk. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All of this software application comes from some really smart young guys, plus the CEO's secret weapon. We have a big beer fridge. <laughs> it's a really, I'm not kidding you, this is the smartest group of people I've ever worked with. Uh, and that's, that's it right there in a nutshell. What's he doing over there? He's got another device so he can control his hands at the same time. He's able to move objects. Is this something that's going to make money, what you do here? Uh, I'd like to think so. That's part of Business 101, isn't it? This crew is very bright indeed, and even if they don't make money, they seem to have a lot of fun.